Hi everyone, welcome to Alka Home of Tarot, November 2020, new month, new dreams, the novelty of the month of November, what is it bringing for all of us? What are the energies for all of us in the month of November? Curious? Well, let's find out. Well, um, I have with me four bells. One is this one, which is a, a, a blue colored one. One is a black one. One is a multicolored one and one is an oval shaped bell. Okay, now I want you to figure out one that you would like. So I'll repeat the blue one, the black one, the oval one or the multicolored one. So now I'm sure that you have thought about it in your mind with your gut feelings, your intuition as to which one is it that you want to go for. Because that is going to determine your energies for the month. And believe me, you are going to do it for yourself. So now if you have taken the bell that was colored blue, then what are your energies for the month? So I am shuffling my cards and... This is what I've picked out for you. This happens to be the Six of Swords. The Six of Swords energy is all about, you know, stepping out of your comfort zone, walking into something new, something undiscovered, totally new, the road not taken, and discovering yourself anew. Of course, this would mean that you're stepping out of something which is very comfortable, very secure, uh, which was actually like a comfort zone for you. And now you're stepping into something which may invite lots of peril, dangers, trials, tribulations. There could be certain obstacles, but they will also be giving you a lot of vigor, a lot of excitement, a lot of energy. And if you're really committed to it, then nobody is going to be able to stop you because you'll be unstoppable in achieving whatever it is that you are going towards in this new month. So the energies is about moving on, you know, leaving something behind, leaving something that is not really serving you so well, leaving it, taking a plunge forward, moving into something unknown and making a mark. So if you had chosen the blue bell, then this is your energy for the month of November 2020. And Friends, my buddies, if you have chosen the multicolored bell, then what are your energies for the month? So your energies for the month are the two of cups. Wow, this is beautiful, romantic energies. Love is in the air. You know, it's all about romance. It's all about bonding with your partner. It's all about bonding with your friends, your family. You know, it's deep connections you will be able to take your love to a different level, you know, for all of them. Uh, not only this, it also, when we have the Two of Cups energy, it also means that there could be some kind of a partnership. Uh, you could be starting out on something new with a partner, a new business venture, or uh, you could be starting out some kind of a project uh, together. And throughout the month, because there's lots of, you know, love and passion involved, you care for each other and plus you are passionate about whatever it is that you are starting this month, it will definitely have a very, very positive outcome. So the energies for the month are all about two-ness, you know, two people coming together, be it in love, be it in a career, be it in a project, be it in some kind of an investment that you make. And the outcome, if the love and the good feelings for each other continue, the mutual trust is there, uh, the feelings of loyalty are there, then believe me, this month will definitely mark the beginning of a new kind of, uh, you know, uh, a new, uh, something new in your life, which will bring a lot of energy, a lot of uh, luck, a lot of good fortune, and of course, a lot of love in your life. Through it, the love will continue flowing in the coming months as well. So if this is a, a bell that you have chosen, 
the multicolored one then it is all about love energies partnerships for the month of november now if you had chosen the oval shaped bell my friends then the energy is this is it is the eight of cups now what is the eight of cup energy this is um Okay, you don't need to get scared, my friend. But, you know, we go through these kind of phases in life also when we would like to just walk away from a situation because it's not really working well for us. You know, um, it's making us feel negative. Now, this could be a relationship. This could be a career. This could be uh, something that you have been doing for a long, long time. And it's very difficult for you to actually, you know, a step away from it and uh, not really... Uh, cling on to it but you know what we have this we as humans have this tendency to cling on to things we don't like to leave them easily but you know the energy for the month says that if you and believe me the energies for the month if you follow them they can always lead to a better future so try to follow this energy if it's asking you to let go of something you know something that does not serve your purpose any longer or some situation some relationship, some venture, which which is taking, draining you completely. You know, it's taken out so much from you. You were invested in something. And chances are it could even be a relationship. If you've invested in that relationship, be it a career, a relationship with your career, a relationship with someone special that you thought, if you had invested so much in it and yet it has not really, you know, it has just drained you. It has left you... Uh, very vulnerable and it has left you negative and it has left you uh, insecure and there's a lack of confidence and a lack of motivation to do anything then my friend it is time for you to move on do follow the energy for the month and good wishes to you and if you have chosen the black bell the black and silver kinds then what are the energies for the month the energies for the month my friends are the Prince of Pentacles. Well, as you know that Pentacles generally is a card, uh, is generally a suit in the tarot deck, which has something to do with materialism, you know, somewhere there is money involved. So it could be that you could get a windfall of some sorts, uh, a, a new, uh, ch a, a kind of a chance to start something new. Um, it could be a new venture. I'm not going to say it's going to be something long lasting. Um, but yes, uh, if you accept it, if you choose to accept it, and even after these powerful energies of the Page of Pentacles leaves you, you know, maybe in the next month it's not with you any longer. If you continue to work hard, if you continue to persevere, then you will definitely be able to reap the fruits of this energy of the Page of Pentacles or the Prince of Pentacles. Now, it is actually, you know, it could be something some new windfall some money coming in with which you can start something new but you need to work really hard it's not that you can just uh, sit down somewhere twiddling your thumbs doing nothing no you need to really work hard at it uh, but believe me i mean if you really persevere and you have that never say die spirit then this energy coming into your life and initiating you into something new and beautiful because you have the energy you have the funds you have the resources at hand believe me even in the coming months when this energy is no longer there with you you will be able to make a mark totally completely on your own with your perseverance well friends that was it from me to all of you the energies for the month and I do hope you have a fantastic November month. November novelty brings in something new in your life, something fresh, something powerful, something rejuvenating, and you feel very special. With that, lots of love from me to all of you. 9910367241. Do like, share, and subscribe to my YouTube channel, Alka Home of Tarot. Do follow me on Facebook and Instagram, hashtag Alka's Tarot. And I love you all. Bye-bye.